Wait, wait. Hit in behind the play, and Portage turns that back over, and Schindel brings that in. He looks over into the seam, nice quick shot, and there you go, first goal for Portage. Not even two minutes in. Oil Caps turned that puck over in the neutral zone, and quickly Portage in transition turned that play back and came back in on the two on one, and no mistake on the shot to the stick side of Wallace. I don't know what happened to the puck all of a sudden, but it's bouncing all over the place. Now played by Arnold as he stole it away. He's in behind, two on one. Gashevsky shoots and he scores! A shorthanded goal for Matt Gashevsky. That crazy bouncing puck. Bounced right to Josh Arnold. Arnold able to step in behind the D, created a two on one. The crossing feed for Gashevsky over on the near side. Well, if they score, we can have some free hockey. If they don't score, it's getting really interesting. Cameron Searles, the captain. Here he comes. Searles. Oh, ties the game! I don't know, is he excited? <laughs> he seems to be. Great, wow. great hands by Searles, who got Pesha to bite on the backhand move, went back to the forehand and slid it home. And with 38.4 sec seconds to go. Lucas Sillinger in his own zone goes up to Rizzo left side. He'll backhand it over to Cilia in stride down low. Curl and drag. Bo scores! Lucas Sillinger! What a beautiful goal from Lucas Sillinger. He curls and drags and goes roof. Ken Tickton leads 4-1. Wow, fantastic speed coming through center. And Cilia just a little shovel pass over to Sillinger on the left side. He drags it into the center, buries it past Diamond as the Bees have found some offense here. And what a fantastic move by 22 in white. Plays it around on the right side. USA on the rush. Boldy with Hughes and Caulfield. Hughes uh, leaving it for Caulfield left side. Another line change for... And they score! Matt Boldy set up by Hughes. That's the second assist of the night for Hughes. This is Hughes working behind the goal. He's going to find Boldy out in front. And Boldy put it in the top shelf. Time of the goal, 13-37. Blue line, far wing, Gaber on the backhand. Gaber on the backhand. Gaber all the way around the net. Comes out the near side. Gaber in the slot. Ty Jackson backdoor. Dylan, they score. Oh, what a passing play for the Fighting Saints. Gaber to Ty to Dylan. It's 2-0 Dubuque. 905 left in the first. That's as good as it gets for the Fighting Saints. And Reese Gaber picks up his 11th point in the last seven games. And Zillish. So we got four forwards on the ice, and the faceoff is won by the Pilots. Muschitello brings it in. He wrists a score! Michael Muschitello ties the game with a minute two left. Oh, baby! What a goal! Genuine to the other side. The Willets back on side. Fenster stock down low. Branshaw. Branshaw will switch it up here. Branshaw at the line. The Willets. Willets with some open time now to Branshaw. One timer across. Genuine scores. There's a hat trick. 51. Logan Genuine's got a hat trick in this game. It's about half old yet. He might set the NA record tonight. Stay tuned. 5-20 into the second period. Power play goal. Logan Genuine, second of the period, is third of the hockey game. And how do you like them apples? That organization during our broadcast tonight. 
Puck played toward the blue line. It squeaks past, and Lawson will lead the rush the other way. Comes up with it, and he scores! Dante Lawson had fallen down and gained control of the puck in the blue paint and when he was able to dish it past Johnny Roberts. And he ties the game, the first junior A goal for Dante Lawson. Trying to hold it in as Canada looks to engage on their forecheck. Good bounce for no seat all alone in front. Posey, are you serious? I think Boisvert kicked up that leg and kept that out. Play continues. Mason, did Boisvert just actually make that save? He did. I saw it all the way. Are you kidding me? Ryan Park with a drive. That one is blocked along the way. Mark Houser's there to hold it in as this top Canada trio doing work offensively. Sleeth with a quick release. And Boisvert catches it with the leather. Portola waits, waits. Picked up again. We can look at this kid go. Was that any good? Nice go! 